Hawaii received the last coal shipment, I believe, two weeks ago, right? So, um, you know, and they were getting weekly shipments, more or less. So that um, was the last shipment, which would uh, have coal until uh, September 1st, which is when uh, the coal plant will be shut down. It really is about um, reducing greenhouse gases, right? And uh, this coal facility is one of the largest emitters. Um, you know, taking it offline means that uh, we'll stop the 1.5 million metric tons of, um, of greenhouse gases that were emitted uh, annually. Um, if you are a believer that climate change is going to end because we shut down this coal plant, this is a great day for you. But if you pay an electricity bill, this is a disastrous day for you. What we're doing in the next few days is transi transitioning from the cheapest fossil fuel to the most expensive fossil fuel. I don't see that as an even trade. And we're gonna be subjected to geopolitical issues on pricing for oil as well as access to oil. And so guaranteed in the next few months, we're all gonna see a dramatic increase in our electricity bills. Yeah, I think renewables are getting cheaper by the day. So if you look 10 years ago, renewables were 10 times the price of, of power of uh, built that they are today. And over the next several years, they should get cheaper and cheaper. So I envision a future where energy is very, very cheap, abundant and renewable at the same time. And this is just the beginning of this transformation. We'll have 10 years of this transition in Hawaii and we'll build a lot more of these projects to help support the, the community. <laughs>